Hello and welcome once again to my 11 plus exam videos. Um, these questions have been taken from the 11 plus CEM tests and it's the CGP 10 minute tests. So let's get started. The first question is um, in each of the questions below, the words can be rearranged to form a sentence. In one word, does it fit in the sentence? Underline the word that doesn't fit. So, for example, red girl has ride girl bicycle. Uh, so, if you try to form a sentence out of it, it would be something like um, uh, the girl. So, it would be the girl has a red bicycle. So, ride is um, not needed in the sentence. So if you go to number one, it would be uh, zoo entertain local A to always trip fun is the. So you either start a sentence with a with a the. So let's start with this. Um, uh, so the uh, trip, the trip to, or you can start with a. Uh, Sorry. So if you start with a, a trip to the uh, local zoo is always fun. So entertain is left out. Then I have number two says read story I sleep usually. A going short to books before. So it could be something like I usually read um, a short story or books. So I think it should be story. Okay. I before going to sleep so books is the out one okay number three is scratch became favorite break it dropped and mug her so you could say it as Vicky start with the noun um Vicky dropped her favorite mug and correct it break so on one out okay the next one is talent she in sync claim that competition play school the so we can say she um uh, sorry it's, it's not the uh, yeah she claimed so it's if you give the she comes out she claimed third place in the talent competition in the school talent competition so sing comes out okay then the fifth one is contains materials our jewel planet diamond life natural many so this one is um we would start with our okay our planet uh, contains our plan our planet contains many natural materials like diamond so jewel comes out so jewel is not needed break is not needed sing is not needed entertain books okay the rest once i crossed out the words not needed the next question is saying find other words that means the same or nearly the same as the word on the left so you have wide and then you have flat straight broad long and then you have days so the broad you see is nearly the same so when you say days 
word that means nearly the same is probably stupor. Okay, then shameless, unabashed, eliminate, eradicate. Uh, yeah, donate is contribute, energize, invigorate. Yes, cacophony is din. Okay, the next one is complete the word on the right so that it means the opposite or nearly the opposite of the word on the left. So we have vague or the opposite is precise. P R E C I S E. Okay, let's see. Uncover. Uncover is conceal. C O N C E A L detrimental is advantageous and why D A G U S engrossed is inattentive I N A T T E N T I V E elaborate is simple the sign in PLE ally is opponent. O P P O N E T opponent. Okay. The next is we have work out which of the options best fits in place of the missing squares in the series. So here what we have is we have these dark parts, um, a lot of trapeziums in black in all of them. So the answer is to have a black trapezium. Okay, so there will be a black trapezium. Then there will be three little triangles. And they have to be in this shape. Because this and this are the same. So it's this one that should be here. Okay, so we should have one, two grays, one new. And one white in the center. So it could be, the answer could be the D or B, two grays and one white in the center. Yeah. It cannot be A or C. Okay, so out of B and D, which is it likely to be? Then look at this pattern. So these are the patterns. And this is, so this one is likely to be this. So and my answer is going to be B, right? Next one, 19, is lines, okay? So this line, my line, has to be like this, a narrow. That makes more sense, okay? And then I'm going to have dots here, 1, 2, 3, 4. And they're going to be gray, not black. So the gray ones are, uh, they're going to be gray. So the gray ones are the option. So this is not an option. And... Any of one of these could be option A, C, and D. But my line is uh, pointing to left corner, bottom left corner. So this is not an option. So my option is definitely, definitely D. Now, one D. Down, down. Sorry, 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 I didn't, sorry, I missed this. Now look at these dots, the shades. The shades are moving, isn't it? So this has to move, so this one has to be shaded. And, and then this has to be shaded. So my answer is this, this is shaded, and then this is shaded, so the answer should be and it's in gray. Yeah, so my answer is A. Okay, that's 19A. The next one is 20. So 20, if you look, this is shrinking and moving. So it's shrinking and moving. Shrinking and moving. It is shrunk 
and mold like the answer you see. Okay, now this one 21 is you have these black, then gray, then pattern, then white. Black, gray, pattern, white. This can be black, gray. No, this is not an option. This so it can be this or it can be this or this. The answer is going to be it looks like it's opening up, so it should be sliding more this way. Okay, it should be more sliding to the left. It looks like my but this the um, pattern should be there. The pattern is the same. So my answer is likely to be 21C. Why is it not 21B? Because it's right, this can't be a pattern anyway. No, sorry, because it's this. So it's this one, okay? Yeah, am I right? Uh, black, black, black gray and then pattern and then white and the white has to be yeah white is thicker so it's then that starts to shrink yeah so it is C my answer is C okay so the next one is this they have a balloon and a cut out then a heart so I think the shapes are changing, isn't it? Yeah, the shapes are all alternate. So if you look at these two, and the color is also changing. So this should come down. So here you should have a shape like this, and here somewhat like this. So this is not an answer. No, this is could be an answer. So it could be either B or C. It could be either of these. Which one of it is it going to be? It is going to be... Look at this one. It's likely to be B is my answer. Okay. Then 23. I have a triangle, square. So three side, four side, five. It has to be six sided, so it can't be this, it has to be A, B, or oh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, so 1, 2, 3, so this cannot be, but it has to be uh, this, so this is not an option, so it has to be the A or B, so in the A or B, the two, the three, three uh, arrows and one arrow has to be smaller so it's likely to be B. Okay, so my answer is B. 24 is 1, 2, th 3 and 4 and then here you have one, two, these little hexagons, big hexagon, little hexagon, big hexagon, little hexagon. This is one, two, three, four, big hexagon, and then a little hexagon. So it could be C or D. Now my question is, how many of these uh, blobs are going to be there? It's going to be one blob, and what will be the color? The color is going to be white, white, two white, two black, two black. So when blacks are decreasing, so it's likely to be a black because a black has two, two then one. It's likely to be a black. So I think I would go with D. Okay, and that's the answer. So this completes this um, this paper. I exceeded the time limits, but um, I got through it. I think you have the questions now and um, you get an idea of how to go around this paper. You may have noticed there was no maths here. Um, it's only uh, verbal and nonverbal reasoning skills. 
So go through it and have fun. Thank you and bye.